The death toll from a boat carrying migrants from Lebanon that sank in Syrian waters has risen to at least 73 state TV quoted Syria's health minister saying on Friday. Syrian authorities have said some family members of the victims have started crossing into Syria from neighboring Lebanon to help identify their loved ones and to drive their bodies. The incident is the deadliest since a surging number of Lebanese Syrians and Palestinians have tried to flee crisis hit Lebanon by sea to Europe. In Lebanon alone, tens of thousands of people have lost their jobs and the Lebanese pound has dropped more than 90% of its value eradicating the purchasing power of thousands of families that now live in extreme poverty. Health Minister Mohammad Hassan Kavers was quoted as saying 20 people are rescued, alive and are receiving treatment at al Basel Hospital in the Syrian coastal city of Tortas. He added that medical authorities have been on alert since Thursday more afternoon to help in the search operations. Earlier today, Earlier Friday, Tata's governor, Abdul Halim Khalil, told the pro-government Sham FM that such is ongoing for more bodies of his country's coast, Khalil said the boat sank two days earlier. A Syrian port official told state news agency Sana that 31 bodies were washed to the shore and the rest were picked up by Syrian boats that began a search operation Thursday. Thousands of Lebanese, Syrians and Palestinians have left Lebanon on boats over the past month seeking better opportunities in Europe. Lebanon has a population of 6 million, including 1 million Syrian refugees, and has been in the grips of a severe economic meltdown since late 2019 that has pulled over three quarters of the population into poverty. In April, a boat carrying dozens of Lebanese, Syrians and Palestinians trying to migrate by sea to Italy went down more than 5 kilometers, 3 miles from the port of Tripoli, following a confrontation with the Lebanese Navy, dozens were killed in the incident. Migrants have been leaving the country from the northern Lebanese coast, the most impoverished region in this small country. On Wednesday, Lebanese officials said naval forces rescuing a boat carrying 55 migrants after it faced technical problems from 7 miles of the coast of the northern region of Agar. It said the people rescued include two pregnant women and two children. This news is from AP Damascus, Syria. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.